everyone, I'm Dion Woods with the Turquoise Iris, and if you're watching this video, it's very likely that you have just purchased one of our Water Girl Continuous Spray Bottles, either from one of your retailers or from paintpixie.com or maybe even from myself. But I thought after using it for the last year, and I'm actually still using the original sample bottle that Josie and Jerry sent for me to try out. Um, it's still working, but I have found out a few things that I thought might help as with any um, it's plastic, it has plastic parts. Um, things start to not work as well as they maybe did when we first got it. So a couple of things that I want you to keep in mind when you're using your water girl. Only put water in this. If you use distilled water, it's even going to be better, especially if you're in an area where there's hard water. Just something to think about if you're on a well. Um, it's something to think about, okay? So with your water girl, when you very first get it, um, you're going to need to kind of load this. Okay. And it's kind of like when you have a lotion bottle and you have to pump, 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 pump for the lotion to actually come out the tip. It's kind of like that. So when you get it and you start spraying, you're like, it's not working. It's not working. Well, give it, you have to fill the reservoir. Okay. So then once you do start spraying it, it sprays for a little while, right? Like it's going to keep going. It's going to keep going. And we've had, um, a few people concerned that it, sprayed for so long and I wanted to explain that very often you will see me in a video on a live or in an, a tutorial and it does the same thing to me but it's continuous and that's what I love about it. I absolutely love that it does more work for me and I get to do less. Okay so one pump I get a lot more water but it comes out in that soft mist spray that we love so much. So you'll see me, it will still be spraying, but I'll just set it down off to the side on my drop cloth or my towel or whatever I have laid down and it's still spraying. Just something really soft, nothing heavy. I don't wanna waste my water and have to go refill it, but it only happens occasionally. It also, if you're gonna spray down this way, after a while, that's with any water bottle, like even from your Windex bottle. If you're spraying this way or trying to spray this way or in all different angles, which we often do as furniture artists or painters or whatever you're using it for, um, that's just something else to keep in mind as well. Um, there's this little guy in here and it gets stuck at the top. Take your lid off and notice this little cylinder ring. All right, it's not hard, it's kind of spongy if it gets stuck up in there in the top, it's not gonna work right. And all you have to do is open it up, get a flathead screwdriver and just go boop and keep it moving, okay? So that's the number one thing I want you to always check for if your water bottle's not working. Um, the other thing is, sometimes we put the, it on too tight. When we twist it too tight, again, some reason, it's plastic, it's a plastic bottle with plastic parts, you guys. So. Think about how tight you're putting it on there. You just need a little, and once it's tight, it's done. You don't have to reinforce that with a lot of, it's almost, it reminds me of like your gas tank. You know, um, my son wants to like twist it like 10 times. I'm like, no, you just need two times, right? So don't over tighten it. Um, if, you, if it happens, open it up, check for the little ring, put it back in there, and let that pressure out of the bottle. All right, without tightening it too tall or too tight, excuse me. So those are my best tips for you. Water distilled if you can, water only. Allow it to build in the reservoir when you first get it. Okay, it's gonna pump up, pump, 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 pump. And I should actually get my actual water bottle. Okay, see how mine keeps going? Make sure that that's loose. And I may only want, see, I've let go and it's still spraying. I don't know if you can hear it, but that's normal, all right? It does the hard part. I just have one pump and it keeps spraying. If you don't want that much water, you just set it aside, all right? But that's the benefit of a continuous spray bottle. So I hope that those tips help and I so appreciate you using the water girl for all of your water bottle needs. Thanks guys.